In downtown North Little Rock, there are essentially no grocery stores nearby. It's a common complaint among people who live there. But tonight, THV 11's Melissa Zigowicz shows us one couple who's relocating their business to give people a new option. The owners are still putting some finishing touches on their store, but they hope this fills a much needed gap in downtown North Little Rock. There's nowhere for anyone around here to get milk, produce, the little things that you need. Downtown North Little Rock is bustling with new apartments and businesses. Um, there's several apartment complexes all around here and there's nowhere where you can grab a gallon of milk or a tomato. But that's about to change. A lot of people are down here, yeah. so we're hoping that, yeah, we'll be very busy. A small scale grocery store called Nana's Organics is opening soon. We had the opportunity to come move on Main Street and what better location? <laughs> <laughs> than downtown North Little Rock. Amanda Wilson is the store's owner. Our main motto is no GMOs. The store will sell mostly organic, locally grown products. Our, all of our meats from Arkansas. Um, all of our eggs are Arkansas. They're farm fresh. We get them once a week. It's a pretty unique setup. We'll be inside of the Galaxy Office Furniture Building. We knew there was a need and, and we had room. Wayne Hogan, owner of Galaxy Furniture, felt putting a grocery store inside his business would be great for our Gentuck. There's a lot more people moving in and living here and uh, you know there's things they need. The grocery store will also operate as a restaurant. We have the food window which is coming soon which all of our food comes packaged to go. Hot sandwiches, soup salads and then a plate special. Wilson hopes Nana's will be useful for those who live around the corner. So we'll be here and they'll be able to get the things that they want and what they need. The Wilsons are still waiting on an inspection from the health department, but they hope to be open by February 1st. Reporting from North Little Rock, Melissa Zigowitz, THV 11 News.